Well, this evening we're going to man up the motor vessel Delaware, uh, exit the Delaware Bay and head for Cadell Shipyard in Staten Island, New York. That's Ferry Captain Peter Dudley, just prior to the motor vessel Delaware sailing overnight from Cape May to the Cadell Shipyard in Staten Island, New York. A $3.5 million repowering project is underway on the Delaware. The first of three vessels in the fleet, the new fuel-efficient engines will save approximately $130,000 per year in fuel costs and reduce emissions by nearly 40 percent. The Delaware sailed under the Verrazano Narrows Bridge early on November 2nd and into New York Harbor, majestically passing the New York skyline on the way to the shipyard. Work began as soon as the ship arrived at the dock. Well, essentially these, these engines are about the size of a uh, smaller tractor trailer, so we'll have to actually cut a hole in the deck, uh, remove the old engines, we'll have to actually cut them into pieces to remove them, and we'll put the new engines in, including new reduction gears. So it's a massive job, probably is going to take about five months, we estimate. Once work is complete, ferry travelers and the environment will benefit from the repowering. Well, the benefits are better fuel consumption, um, increased horsepower, so we'll be able to run the vessel at a higher speed, and definitely a decrease in the pollutants that the uh, engine puts out. We're all excited here at the ferry to get this job done. Um, the engines in there were designed in 1938. Uh, there are issues with parts on them there now, so we'll be uh, very happy to get modern engines there. We're looking forward to doing all three vessels. The motor vessel Delaware is expected to return to the fleet in the spring. Keep an eye on CMLF.com and social media for updates.